Carbon is the most chemically active ingredient in the entire periodic table. If you were to find a chemistry on which to base something really complex called life, you would base it on carbon. Carbon is like the fourth most abundant ingredient in the universe. Isn't that rare? You can make more molecules out of carbon than you can all other kinds of molecules combined. So if we ask ourselves, are we alone in the universe, it would be, in spite of my diatribe about UFOs, I tell you in the same breath that it would be inexcusably egocentric to suggest that we are alone in the cosmos. The chemistry is too rich to declare that. The universe, too vast. There are more stars in the universe than grains of sand in all the beaches of the world. There are more stars in the universe than all the sounds and words ever uttered by all humans who have ever lived. To say we're alone in the universe. No, we haven't found life outside of Earth yet. We're looking, haven't looked very far yet. <laughs> Galaxies this big, we looked about that far. But we're looking. And how about life on Earth? How, is it hard to form? Just because we don't know how to do it in the lab doesn't mean nature had problems. So it may be, given that information, that given the right ingredients, which are everywhere, life may be inevitable, an inevitable consequence of complex chemistry. 